Okay? This is another week and this is another episode of your vlog, my vlog, our favorite vlog, My Weird Wednesdays. This is Orlando Kispe reporting from Culiacá, Peru. As always, or as usual, maybe. And today we have some interesting and important topics, at least important to me, to talk about. For example, uh, last Sunday, uh, May 14th, we celebrated something very uh, important here in Peru. And I know that it was celebrated also in other countries uh, all over the world. But... Well, this is the Mother's Day, and I know that the, the date is, uh, is different from country to country, but uh, in Peru we celebrate it on the second Sunday of May, and so uh, that, that was last Sunday. And so I think it's a good idea to try to... to Reminize to try to rescue the the essence, the original essence of of the meaning of this date. And Jarvis uh, tried to uh, make this date instituted because of her deceased mother. And uh, well, she she eventually uh, succeeded in her. In, in, in her commitment, but uh, sadly enough, well, the the commercial aspect of this uh, ended up uh, burying all the original meaning of this of this celebration and this commemoration, and uh, she spent every single second and every single dime she had in order to try to stop what she. Uh, what she started, and I think it's kind of uh, frustrating uh, to know that something that you had the good intention to give, not just for you, but just for the world, but also for the world, uh, ended up being something that you uh, you ended up regretting for the rest of your life. Well, uh, that consideration aside, I would like to to make a big shout out for all the mothers here in Peru, all the mothers in, in Latin America, although there are some countries that have a slightly different date, like Bolivia and Argentina, as far as I know. And uh, I obviously want to greet all the mothers that, can, that are part of the public uh, in, in the United States. and. I hope you have had a very uh, a very special day last Sunday, and I would like to talk a little more about my mother. My mother is a very uh, important person for me. Um, she is a survivor of cancer. She had to to go through a lot, and uh, by doing so, she showed me and taught me a lot of valuable lessons and uh, that's why I love her so much and it's not just because she's my mother and I ought and I ought to do it but uh, it's also the things that she did for me and for my siblings and also the things that she did for herself and uh, I consider that that's one of the reasons I admire her so much so hi mom <laughs> and uh, well I know she's gonna watch this video and um, well I also wanted to talk about something I knew this uh, via whatsapp so I'm not sure if this is correct if it's not please correct me in the in the comments uh, tomorrow it's supposed to be uh, so, uh, a commemoration about cancer though uh, I'm not sure I'm not sure exactly how uh, it is related to that though so I might be I might be wrong but I want to talk about this topic because I consider it's uh, it's something 
important and so uh, we should take care of our health it's something really really important and so uh, we should remember this kind of dates but not just to to panic and say oh no I'm gonna get cancer because if if I eat this or I'm gonna get cancer if I if I do this and it's not just it, that's not a good idea okay so what you should do is to try to have a balanced uh, healthy um, um, nutrition and, uh, and obviously uh, doing exercise regularly trying to sleep well and trying to cope with stress in a, in a positive way and try to have a, a positive mindset in life it helps a lot and I know it for sure because I had to 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 go through my my share of of health issues <laughs> in this life and so I know what I'm talking about um, maybe we'll talk about that later in, in another in another episode of the vlog so uh, well we should take care of this and uh, obviously um, Another thing that I wanted to talk about is about uh, I I'm, I knew this via Facebook, so I'm not sure about this either. I think today it's the commemoration for the day against homophobia and transphobia and and, and things like that. And so uh, I would like to point out that we should really pay attention to what we say because what we think could be uh, an hilarious joke can end up being something really hurtful for another person so we should really pay attention to what we say and the people who we are sur surrounded and so uh, we should take uh, we should uh, pay attention about that Okay, another thing that I would like to say about this is that we should seek for uh, um, equity more than equality. Because when you talk about equality, you are uh, thinking about things being uniform for everyone, right? But equity uh, takes it to another level because it considers, it takes into the account all the different circumstances and all the inherent, inherent differences that we have as people and so it, it makes this equality really equal and, and, and something fair for people so more than seeking equality we should seek for equity okay and so well thank you for, for being there Thank you for 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 all of the views. We have more than one one thousand one hundred and seven views up to this moment in the channel. I'm really thrilled. I'm really dazzled about this. Uh, I I never expected something like this. And and I want to thank especially to five five countries. Uh, they are uh, France, Austria. The United Kingdom, Indonesia, and the other one I forgot. Uh, let me let me check the the statistics in, in on, on YouTube. It's uh, oh the Netherlands also. We have like one view from each place, and uh, even though it's just one view, I really treasure this. I really. I really think it's something very important for me. So a big shout out to these five countries. And uh, well, this is everything for this week.